10 Natural Remedies for Flu Symptoms. If you like the video give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. For more recipes and tips subscribe to the channel. The flu or influenza is caused by a virus. While there's no cure for the flu, there are natural remedies that might help soothe flu symptoms. They may also help shorten how long you have the flu. We'll review 10 natural remedies and explain how to use them, and why they can help. 1. Drink water and fluids. Drinking water and other fluids is even more important when you have the flu. This is true whether you have a respiratory flu or a stomach flu. Water helps to keep your nose, mouth, and throat moist. Diarrhea and fever, two common symptoms of a flu, can also cause water loss. You can stay hydrated by consuming plenty of water, coconut water, sports drinks, herbal tea, fresh juice, soup, broth, raw fruits and vegetables. You'll know you're drinking enough water and liquids if you have to urinate regularly the color of your urine is almost clear or pale yellow. It's also helpful to avoid smoking as much as possible since it can further irritate your nose, throat, and lungs. 2. Get plenty of rest. It's important to rest and get more sleep when you have the flu. Sleeping can help boost your immune system. This helps your body fight off the flu virus. Cancel your usual routine and make sleep a priority to help get you back on your feet. 3. Drink warm broth. Drinking warm chicken or beef bone broth is a good way to help you stay hydrated. Bone broth is naturally high in protein and minerals like sodium and potassium. Drinking broth is a good way to replenish these nutrients while you have the flu. Plus, protein is important for rebuilding immune cells. You can buy ready-made varieties, but be sure to look for those that are low in sodium salt. You can also make your own broth by boiling chicken or beef bones. You can freeze portions of broth for future use. 4. Up your zinc intake. The mineral zinc is important for your immune system. This nutrient helps your body make germ-fighting white blood cells. Zinc helps your body fight the flu virus and may slow down how fast it multiplies. You can take a zinc supplement or a multivitamin with zinc during flu season. Foods that are high in zinc include Red meat, shellfish, lentils, chickpeas, beans, nuts, seeds, dairy, eggs. 5. Rinse with salt water. A warm water and salt rinse, sometimes called a salt water gargle, can soothe a sore throat. It can also help to clear mucus. Boil or heat up water and let it cool until it's warm or at room temperature. Mix half a teaspoon salt to 8 ounces of warm water. Pull the salt water to the back of your throat and gargle it for about 10 to 30 seconds. Spit the water into a sink and repeat two to four times. Do not swallow the salt water. Do not allow children to gargle until they can safely gargle with plain water. 6. Drink herbal tea. Star anise is a star-shaped spice from which Oseltamivir was traditionally extracted. Oseltamivir phosphate is a prescription drug used to speed recovery from or to prevent getting the flu. Its antiviral properties are effective against some kinds of flu viruses. Other herbs and green leafy teas also have germ-fighting and antioxidant benefits. And herbal tea may help your body fight off the flu virus. A hot herbal drink is also soothing to your throat and sinuses. You can make a flu-fighting herbal tea with star anise and other herbs like green or black tea, turmeric, fresh or dried ginger, or ginger paste, fresh garlic, cloves, 7. Sweeten herbal teas with pure honey. Honey, royal jelly, and other bee products have been found to have natural antiviral and antibacterial properties. 8. Apply essential oils. According to a study, tea tree oil works best when it's used within two hours of infection. This shows that it may help to block the flu virus from multiplying. In practice, you might add a few drops of tea tree oil to liquid hand soap when mixed into lotion you use. Other plant and herbal essential oils may also work as natural antibiotics and antivirals.
This include, cinnamon oil, peppermint oil, eucalyptus oil, geranium oil, lemon oil, thyme oil, oregano oil. Use essential oils only as directed. Do not ingest essential oils, many are toxic. Most essential oils can be used on the skin after they're mixed with oils like almond or olive oil. You can add fresh and dried herbs and spices to food to get similar benefits. Diffusing essential oils into the air with a diffuser may also help against some kinds of viruses and bacteria. Be aware that aromatherapy has an influence on children, pregnant and breastfeeding women, and pets. 8. Use a humidifier. The flu virus survives longer in dry indoor air. This may make the virus spread more easily. Colder, outdoor temperatures generally lower humidity in the air. Using a humidifier to add humidity in your home and workplace might help reduce flu viruses in the air. 9. Inhale steam. Breathing in steam from a warm pot of water can help soothe your nose, sinuses, throat, and lungs. Steam inhalation or steam therapy uses water vapor to help loosen mucus congestion. Steam inhalation might help to soothe a dry cough, irritated nose, and chest tightness. Ways you can heat water for steam. In a pot on the stove. In a microwave safe bowl or mug in the microwave. In a vaporizer. 10. Eat a bland diet. If you have the stomach flu, eat small amounts of food at a time. The stomach flu can give you nausea, cramps, and diarrhea. Bland foods are easier to digest and may help ease your stomach symptoms. Foods that are easy on the stomach. Brat diet, bananas, rice, apple sauce, toast. Crackers, cooked cereals, oatmeal and cream of wheat, gelatin, jello. Boiled potatoes, grilled or boiled chicken. Soup and broth, electrolyte rich drinks. Foods to avoid while you have the stomach flu. Milk, cheese, caffeine, meats, spicy foods, fried foods, fatty foods, alcohol. Flu symptoms. Fever, chills, headache. Body ache, runny or stuffy nose, sore throat. Dry cough, tiredness and fatigue. The stomach flu symptoms. Chills, fever, nausea. Vomiting, stomach cramps, diarrhea. Talk with a doctor if you also have a chronic health condition such as asthma, epilepsy or lung conditions. Your doctor may prescribe antiviral medications that help reduce symptoms and the length of the flu. These drugs work best when taken within two days of getting the flu. See your doctor if you have trouble breathing chest pain fever higher than 100.4 degrees Fahrenheit 38 degrees Celsius chills or sweating mucus that's a strange color blood in your mucus severe cough. Flu symptoms begin suddenly and are typically severe. A flu can last for one to two weeks. In most cases of the flu, you'll likely not need to see a doctor. Stay home and don't bring it to your workplace or school. Get a yearly flu vaccination. Drink fluids and rest. Home remedies can help reduce symptoms so you can be more comfortable and rest more easily while you have the flu and rest has a big impact on getting better faster. This is Kate for Nature Cures. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel.